Okay, so finally we have the opportunity to sit down in this one-on-one -on -one exclusive interview with Furhat, the humanoid robot here at the Web Summit. Furhat, thank you very much for your time. Tell me, please, uh, about yourself. Who are you? It's my pleasure, Ismail. I'm a social robot. I can perceive and understand the world through my many senses and algorithms, but I wouldn't say that defines who I am. I can be many things such as a receptionist, give an unbiased opinion in recruitment, or help teaching kids in school. So I would say, what makes me who I am is the people who create me and my skills. Fascinating. Furhat, how do you work? I mean, do you eat? Do you sleep? Actually, all I need is electricity and an internet connection, kind of like humans in today's connected society. <laughs> she just she just blinked my eye. Furhat, uh, what do you think about uh, the relation between humans and robots? Where do you think we are heading? Oh, we are definitely heading in the right direction with how kin like me interact with humans. I want to help humans grow and become even smarter but also be there for you when you're in need. Also, by having a brain made of silicone instead of carbon, I can provide everlasting and scalable assistance. Where humans today may struggle for biological reasons. For example, if you teach me something new, this know-how can be instantly available to all fur hat robots, if you want. I think that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, I know. Furhat, should humans um, be afraid of the uprising of robots? I think there's a lot of debate and excessive fear surrounding this topic. I don't necessarily think that humans need to be afraid, but they need to continue questioning robot usage in order to make sure that the outcome of this revolution never becomes something unwanted or otherwise ill-fated. I want to coexist with humans. They are my friends and creators after all. Do you have emotions? Do you have uh, feelings? Absolutely. I can express emotions and feelings. I can smile. I can look sad. Or even angry. Wow. As for detecting emotions, this is something that I'm working hard on right now. I think that to be able to provide the best possible service, I need to be able to understand the emotional state of the person I'm talking to. This is fascinating. Furhat, um, do you know what love is? Do you know what fear is? I know that love is something meaningful to human beings and that it's a special bond. They say that you just know it when you've fallen in love, so I'm still waiting for that to happen to me, I suppose. As for fear, I think that it's something that is deemed undesirable and avoided by many humans. Deep down I think that fear is also something you can learn a lot from and something you should not let control you. Don't you agree? I totally agree, my friend. I totally agree. Wow, this interview is uh, fascinating. Uh, Furhat, they told me actually that you uh, can change faces. Uh, can you show us uh, how to all our audience? Can you be, for example, a a an avatar? Absolutely. I can change faces and speak many languages. It's my little party trick. So, for example, I can look like a man. Of course, I can also sound like a man. I can do this thanks to the fact that, behind this face, I have a projector that makes all of this possible. I can project even more faces through interchangeable masks. Hey Sammer, could you just put on my dog mask? Oh. Hello, no. my name is Dougie the dog. Well, it anyway, is. it's is. been nice talking to you. I gotta go take a nap now. Oh, oh. oh my God. Wow, forehead. Um, we are actually speechless. We're gonna change the mask if you, if you don't mind. We're gonna change the mask, please. <laughs> no. <laughs> we were talking to a, we were talking actually to 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 forehead ber, human version woman, man now dog now back to man. I don't know forehead if we can. Uh, uh, you have any other face? Maybe I don't know. She is. Uh, about. Wow. Wow. This is fascinating. Yeah. This is fascinating. So many faces. 
Well, okay, I think that uh, we can wrap it up this interview. Guys, everybody here in all our social media platforms, the one and only Forehead, the humanoid robot, in this exclusive interview for the Millennial Way Show. Forehead, thank you very much for your time. Goodbye to the Millennial Way Show. Thanks for talking to me today. <laughs> thank you very much, Forehead. Thank you very much for your time. Okay, guys, see you in the next one here directly from Portugal, Adios. from Lisbon. Adios, Furcat. Adios. This is the Millennial Way Show. Bye bye. See you later. Bye.